everybody, welcome back. Uh, we are headed right into the new year, so we wanted to talk to you guys about New Year's resolutions and new beginnings. Mm -hmm. Um, because a lot of people um, kind of plan that stuff as we get into January. So, yes. uh, what about you? Do you have any New Year's resolutions? Uh, I mean, kind of, but <laughs> <laughs> I guess it's hard because with New Year's, New Year's resolutions, I get so excited, I get pumped to do it, and then it doesn't happen. I think a starts, lot of people get that way. Yeah, it starts and then it's it like just super spindles. exciting to yeah. start. And you're all like, yes, we're gonna do this. It's gonna be great. And then the ex the excitement like goes away. Yeah, <laughs> and then you get things get busy, something happens. You, it's like things can happen. And you never know what the year's gonna bring. And I think that I didn't make a New Year's, re New Year's resolution last year because I'm like, I'm, I'm not going to worry about it. I'm pretty sure I did not make one last year either. And I'm pretty sure this year I'm not going to make one because I think part of it is there is this like standard that we put on ourselves. Mm -hmm. Like we're going to do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's great for people that do it and they can follow through with it. But if you are one of the ones like me who can't follow through with things. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, not all things, but like right. in this situation, for whatever reason, I just, I never can complete a New Year's resolution. <laughs> so it does not work my time. <laughs> um, uh, so. so that's kind of why we chose the title for this one to be New Beginnings mm -hmm. because we are beginning a new year and so we're not actually doing any resolutions, but just celebrating the fact that we're in a new year. Right, and new things can happen in this year. I mean, that's right. There's some bad, bad but there can be good things that happen in this year too. Um, I mean, okay, one resolution I would do, hopefully, by the end of, by this time next, by the end of next year, 2022. I feel like it wouldn't be a resolution, it would be like a wish list. It's a wish list. I have yeah. a wish list for 2022. I think a, a, a wish list is okay. So actually, <laughs> to do really like a thing. we would love for you guys to post your wish lists for 2022 in the comments. That's what we want to hear. Not your resolutions, your wish list. And we'll see if it happens. <laughs> That's right. And then we can look back and see, okay, check, check, check. <laughs> or, you know, your wish, wish list could change. We, we never right. know. Yeah. So, so okay, I, God, what's your wish? I want to be able to finish a book that I have been wanting to write for a while. Um, it'll be a Christian book about, I don't want to say anything right now because. Yeah, don't say anything. I'm not going to say anything right now, but. It's, that can be your number <laughs> one wish on your wish list. Yes. Number, well, that's my number two on the wish list. Oh, sorry. My number, number one. Two. <laughs> okay. Aside the fact, you know, growing more in the Lord, you know. Well, yeah, the basic that's, stuff, that's, but that's, that's a given. given. That's a given every, every day, every year. Um, and that's just like a progress. A wish list a boyfriend to not be single anymore. Well, even though I know you really, really want that, you should still enjoy the singleness because... I am trying to enjoy the singleness. Yes. yes. <laughs> Boyfriends and husbands, shh, <laughs> um, can weigh you down at times. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay. I really love my husband. <laughs> they're going to be like, who is this person? No, he's really great. He's really great. And actually, I would not survive Sorry. without him. So I'm just really, I truly am teasing. But. We, we joke a lot. So just know that ahead of time. I hope nobody gets but offended. But I think, though, too, like being single, you get different perspective of things. Right. So, like, and that's another discussion we will have at another yes, time. Did we, we write that down? I don't know if we did. So that will be one that we, we can discuss add. That. Um, but it would be, it's really interesting to see the dynamics of single versus married and single versus married versus dating because they're, they're just different for every person and it can mean different things mm -hmm. for people. So yes, but yeah. But yeah, aside from that to finish my book, I think that is a really, really good wish on your wish list. Mm -hmm. So, I don't know if I have one. I mean, mine are always all the same. Like We need to go to a conference or oh, a yeah. growth I, trip or something. I That's another really, thing on my wish list. I guess that would be on my wish list because I really do want to do a conference. I've been wanting to do one for like, I don't know, years. And the one that I 
Almost women, women's was able conference. To. Yeah, so women's conference. And the one that I almost was able to do, I was out of town and couldn't do it. So I was really bummed. Um, one of my other friends at the other at her church um, mm -hmm. had a conference, and oh. I couldn't go to it. So, um, so yeah, that would be, I guess, one on my wish list. I really would like to go to a conference um, and do that, and maybe just like I kind of. This probably sounds really stupid, but I just want to be joyful. Like, I know circumstances and situations can be really, really stinky, but I want to have joy even in those, because I don't always get that way. I get really, like, complainy. I'm I discouraged, really, just yes, depressed. But mostly complainy. Like, People have to listen to me complain. And I'm like, I am not a joyful person right now because I'm complaining. So um, it's kind of like an attitude change on yeah. my wish list. So it will be very hard to do, but I'm going to try to do something like that because I can get really complainy and it's not good. <laughs> Another thing, we could probably, another thing with resolutions, there's no accountability partner. Oh, yeah, I that's think true. that's something else to consider too is. That could help somebody actually keep a resolution. Keep a resolution. Mm -hmm. So I think if we had things that we wanted to do, then let's find an accountability partner. Oh, another thing on my wish list, to be content, to find the joy in being single. Well, your wish list just keeps getting bigger, and mine is like nothing. I'm sorry. I have a lot of <laughs> needs. <laughs> no, I think it's good. I think it's really good, and I think that I need to add more to mine. <laughs> I'm sure that's the thing. With It's a new beginning, so I'm sure things are going to be added in, and it's like... What's great is you can add in mid-year. So, like, in June, you're like, oh, hey, I meant to add this. Not that you can skip back to January and add it, but you right. can start in June. <laughs> So with like the wish list and things that, you know, maybe by the end of the year, things don't, you can't, you can't check things off, but the good thing about it is then it's a new beginning. Right. And you could leave that on your wish list for, for the, next the next year. year. And then well, bam, yeah. try again. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe even midway through the year, you will say, I don't need this anymore. And that's the cool thing. It's like we grow. It's, it's, we're right. always learning and There's growing. There's growth and change and newness yes. of everything's changing. <laughs> thing, life, not life, life, new Newness experiences, of growth, ideas. <laughs> Something. <laughs> Let me get the point. Apparently, we're tired today. <laughs> I'm very tired. I'm a teacher. I'm always tired. <laughs> no, but I think it's good, and I think that um, I should get on adding some more to mine, but I don't know what I'm going to add yet. Always, like, trying to be good for my kids, though, too. I think that's another reason, like, I don't want to be complainy mm -hmm. is because... Um, it can get stressful with the kids sometimes. Yeah. And I can get overwhelmed and irritated very easily, and I try really, really hard to contain that. Um, but if I don't have a good outlet, then it it kind of just goes haywire. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, I think it'll be good. And I'm super excited about the new year, especially because we've had so much crazy the last couple of years. We need a new beginning, guys. Like, um, yes. not that I want to forget any of the old stuff. No. It's so important to know where we came from and to work um, towards something and work, you know, progress mm -hmm. as we go. Right. So. Yeah, I agree. Uh, any other things we need to touch on, do you think? I don't or? think so. I think that's everything. So you guys let us know what your wish is on your wish list is. And uh, we can't wait to hear what they are. And whenever I come up with the rest of my list, hopefully I'll be able to share that with you And guys. before we end that, we should probably, from a Christian perspective, with a wish list, sometimes the Lord may have a different idea for us than what we think. This is Or true. we hope for and wish for. Right, sometimes what we want is not what is in our best interest, and the Lord knows that, and so we don't always get it, so, and that's okay, it needs to be okay, which I guess goes with your content wish, because those things, they're not always good. <laughs> we think they're good, mm -hmm. um, but we also don't see the bigger picture. Right. So. And it's God might be saying that right now. We never know. Um, 
I've had so many situations where it was it's either a no or it's that. not what. I was just like, well, this whole, t- that particular um, comment, I was reading in one of my books this morning. Um, it was all about that. Just like um, understanding and knowing that sometimes what we want is not what the Lord wants for us. Whether at all or not yet. Right. Um, so I thought it was just, it was a, it was a good read, mm-hmm. but it was interesting that you brought that up. Cause yeah, that was something I read this morning. So, right. It's very cool. But, and always set at least realistic expectations for yourselves. Well, yeah. Cause if you're not, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> if you're not, you're just, we're going to just set ourselves well, up for failure, but sometimes those things could happen. I guess. Okay. Yeah. I mean, sometimes God can do the impossible. We know that. Right. He can. Will he is the other thing, right? I think I go back to, like, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, where they're like, well, God will deliver us, but if he doesn't, right, because right. they know he can. Right. Um, and it's just that knowing that God can do whatever, um, but will he? We don't really know that. We're, you know... We want him to do certain things mm-hmm. in our lives, but we don't always know if he's going to. And that's part of the faith. You know, you're walking. Right. And just, it's a growing. Yeah. So, so it's, it's good. It's a learning curve. So that's yeah, really good. So yeah. So guys, leave us your wishes and um, we're excited to start the new year with you guys. Right? Yes. So, and then as a, Side note as well, once January starts, we're going to be, we're skipping next week, right? For, we've been posting a lot the past few weeks. Yeah, so we've been doing a lot of weekly ones, um, and once we hit, get into January, um, we are going to switch to like every other week. So, yeah, and we're learning as we're going. This is new for us too, so this is our new beginning. That's right. This, this is another one. I guess I could add this to my wish list. Yeah. Speak well in front of camera. No? <laughs> yeah, speak more in front of camera for me because <laughs> you're doing all the talking. I talk too much all the time, though. Even I, like in a natural setting, right, I talk. True. <laughs> this is normal. Um, but um, so, so yeah, it's, it's going to be every other week unless we decide to throw in some other ones but yeah if there's anything you guys want us to throw in we could always throw in just random ones occasionally right Um, but for the most part it's going to be about every other week um so just discussing just a lot of different stuff yeah it's going to be just like this banter back and forth yes (laughs) (laughs) so all right so yeah so we shall see you in the new year 2022 bye-bye bye guys